Hey, this is Brian, and I'm going to be reviewing the Velvet Pedals Umble today. It's an overdrive, and I'll play you a clip of me playing through it with a backing track. Here goes. some clean tones. This is my neck pickup. And here's my um, bridge pickup. get on to some uh, gain tones so here's the low gain and here's what this sounds like with everything on noon <laughs> see what this sounds like after I boost it. Here's my bridge. So very cool. It, it does add a bunch of grit to it. Um, like I said, it does sound like <laughs> an amp being pushed pretty hard. And it has a very complex kind of gritty personality that I really dig. It does those really nice Robin Ford tones as well as some really nice SRV tones as well. And yeah, let's go into the next video where I show you what the tone knobs do. Alright, let's get into uh, tone manipulation and I guess we can start out with seeing how much gain we can get out of this thing. So let's check it out. Um, I'll just play a couple simple chords and just like back off the volume and bring it back up again. So this is at noon. <laughs> a little bit lower. Alright. Here's a little bit up more. Cool. Let's do that with the bridge pickup now.
as you can see, it varies like crazy depending on how much volume you put on. Um, let's see about this gain boost right here. Let's see how much this adds. <laughs> It can go from a very, very light overdrive to very thick, very, you know, complex harmonically speaking. All right, cool. So let's actually do some of the tone knobs now instead of the gain knob. Um, so this pedal is so insanely tweakable. It's really tough to like get all the different tone combinations. I can't show you all of them, so let's just uh, be really drastic with the tone knobs and hopefully it will give you a good idea of how well these control. So we'll start out at noon of course. <laughs> Let's put it up all the way. So the first thing I noticed is that it gives it a lot more balls. I could say that, right? the tone a little bit, kind of gives it an extra little bit of kick and girth. Cool. Alright. Let's try the mid knob now. Let's pump it all the way up. Well, let's do a noon right now first. Alright. So now, tone comparison. So a lot more kind of high mid sparkle there. This is more, in my opinion, it boosts the highs, the high mids a lot more than the lows. And let's check this out. Whoa, that's a drastic difference right there. So with that <laughs> that out of the way, it's completely scooped. All right, that was cool. Very interesting. Um, let's see now the treble. Bunch of highs right there. And let's see what happens if you take it down. So, yeah, 
Um, I guess the treble doesn't change as much as maybe the mids or the bass does uh, when it's taken all the way down. This pedal has a really kind of bright character to it. Um, you can tell right away. Um, it's also a very loud pedal. And I don't know, it's really cool. It's very present. If you um, ever need to cut through the mix, cut through the mix when you're playing live, this will definitely, definitely do it. It'll, it'll totally punch right through, um, which is another great thing about this pedal. So um, I guess that kind of concludes our short demo. Um, I will be doing a comparison of the Umble and Katana. So, um, yeah, we'll see you in the next video, hopefully. I'll get that done soon.